is not being hit by the bombs. What I don't like, and I have to be careful, you know, I belong to the Jewish Life Square every morning, and I was talking to a lady, yeah. and I said, it sat on both sides. I, you know, I have a Muslim friend, I have a... Uh, I'm recording now. I oh, just want to, yeah. Okay, go ahead. I have a Muslim friend, yeah. and I have um, an Israeli friend, and they can both see each other's mm. sides. They're both very long people. But I said at the wall, I said, it's very sad on both sides, the Palestinians and the Jews. And this woman started screaming her head off. You want the Palestinians to leave or to die. Leave or die, that's the option that they're presenting them. That's negotiations, I negotiating know. position. Are you, are, you, um, are you Israeli by birth? Or? No, 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 no. I was born in Toronto, but I was conceived in a Jewish refugee camp after the war, yeah. after the Holocaust. Oh, My parents are escaped hey, from Poland into the Russia. Oh, I, I put stickers on them. Yeah, yeah it works. No, I mean, what happened on October 7th breaks my heart when I think of what they did. It's like the second But, uh, you know, a lot the of that is uh, just horror stories. I know. It's, it's not on both sides. Well, I, I'm talking about, you know, the major sort of, you know, horror atrocities that yeah, the Hamas know. is accused of. There's uh, no, uh, no proof to that effect. You know, yeah. there's a, I, one Zionist last week told me to go and look at the website uh, HamasMassacre.com. Yeah. I went and had a list of the, the major, you know, like accusations, and you're supposed to click on that link to get the videos that are the proof. Yeah. There's no proof. Yeah, there's no proof that Hamas committed the atrocities. Not only that, Hamas didn't uh, commit such uh, atrocities. What their strategy was, was to take hostages in order to get the Palestinian prisoners freed from Israel's jails. That was their strategy. Now, there were others who came across the border, yeah. who were looters, you know, who were not disciplined, you know, people, who may have committed some, you know, individual atrocities, okay? So yeah. those people should be prosecuted. But it's not Hamas' uh, strategy, you know. Well, then who took the hostages, then? Hamas, in order yeah. to get the Palestinian prisoners free. And it was working for a while, they would free some... But Israel cut off negotiations. Situation, you know? It's not like Ukraine and, and Russia. No. Putin is a nutcase anywhere, and he's destroyed a country. And to me, there's no, well, two, there's no two sides to Russia and Ukraine. Putin th doesn't want to be another nation. I don't take uh, I don't take sides in uh, Russia Ukraine. I support Donbass. <laughs> Just kidding. You know, the, the, the Lugansk and Gonesk, you know, have been trying to become uh, autonomous or independent. You know, s since the uh, 19 uh, the 2014, you know, uh, yeah. uh, coup d'état there, which created a centralized nation state. And then the um, army was sent to occupy, you know, the Donbass region. So, you know, I'm opposed to that. I, I'm not, a, I'm opposed to the occupation of Ukraine as well, but that's not what Russia is doing, I don't think, you know, because they're just located in the eastern well, provinces. Why did they go into Ukraine? They want to take Ukraine back. And no. It, it, it was Russia who created Ukraine. It was, you know, Lenin yeah, actually. But that was then, now it's now. Ukraine has become a, I mean, you could say Yugoslavia. Well, Tito kept kept them all together and now yeah I, I mean there's but 
you know, if once the Ukraine decided to become a nation state, that is, you know, for only one nation, only speaking Ukrainian, and Russian was, you know, forbidden, well, then all of a sudden, all of a sudden, there's, there's nearly the same language anyway, you know, yeah. But, you know, uh, once that uh, was the official policy, then the eastern provinces were ostracized, and, and they didn't want to uh, remain. And so by referendum, they, anyway, that's another matter. But uh, uh, Hamas is... Uh, Are you bilingual? Uh, Are you French? Are you bilingual? Oui, oui. Oh, vous êtes très gentil. Vous êtes très gentil. Moi, moi je ne suis pas assez bilingue. Ah. J'ai visité Paris, cet été passé. Ah. Et cet été, je vais aller. But oh, more j'aime important. votre chapeau, madame. Madame, j'aime votre chapeau. C'est joli. I like your hat. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I never want to speak French or English. I live in the building. But my home. first language is neither. My first language is Yiddish. Ich rede Yiddish. Oh, just oh, it's, it's French or Deutsch, so. Oh, it's Deutsch. This is only the Yiddish. Yeah. yeah. But my parents didn't speak English when I was born, when they came here. So they spoke to me in Yiddish. And well, then I had to learn English and so French on my own. This is Sandra. Yes, Sandra. So you speak Spanish? Spanish, yeah. French, English. Oh, that's completely bilingual. Three. Mm-hmm. Right, three lines. <laughs> Pardon? Three lines. Three lines. I'm Spanish. Spanish, English.